Hi, it's Candace and Hey for look I got. Hey. Look I got. Pepper. He don't want to be messed with. But that's Pepper Mooney. He's tired and I'm tired. And we got baby Remus. We're a pup Remus. He's so cute. Ever so adorable. So, we are here to do Vlogtober Day 13 and to say Happy Friday the 13th! Yay! I've always had good. Oh, got. Well, did it twice. Flung him down on his face. I've always had great days on Friday the 13th. Even had lucky days on Friday the 13th. So, um, I love this day. And, um,. Considering it's been a rough week, um, rough couple weeks, had a pretty good day today. <coughs> um, my neighbor friend, Debbie, and I have been cleaning all day. Um, even though stuff is still chaos, it is looking so good. Um, Debbie thinks <laughs> by tomorrow we'll have the... Um, la uh, la 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 the kitchen, um, la and laundry room, which sits off the kitchen area, and bathroom, <laughs> and living room finished, and then that just leaves finishing the bedroom and office, yay! And they're both almost pretty much almost done as well um so it's just been a matter of organizing i just ordered two um jumbo um hammocks for my all my plushies i'm gonna do you know just general um and geeky hammock pl uh plushies in one hammock and then horror in the other and then, um, so that will get some of that out of the way. But other than that, we are almost finished. I'm so excited. Um, try not to get emotional. Um, Debbie gets on me for that. <laughs> She's like, don't you, don't you cry. Don't you get emotional. So I'm trying not to. Um, it's really very exciting. Um, and the fact I'm, I'm on anxiety meds now. Um, I've slept well very very well um and quite hard for the last uh couple of nights since being on a uh, new medication uh the clonopin kicks my arse but um i needed that it works pretty good so um i haven't even taken tonight's dose yet but you know look at my eyes i'm like <clears throat> you know i'm all ready to go to bed i am one tired girl but, uh, been a great Friday the 13th. I was getting ready to go to the post office this morning. Uh, got a text from my homegirl, Nita, who works up, you know, as manager up at the GameStop right across, uh, right up the street from me. Um, you know, she gave me some very sad news, and I'm very heartbroken over it. But I won't say anything about that till closer time. Uh, look at that. I just dyed my hair, and I gotta do it again. Next week before Walker Stalker. But anyway, she wanted me to come up to her GameStop because she had something for me. And after I left there, actually, since I'm getting ready to do Remus's uh, rooting on his hair, I kept forgetting to stop and somewhere and get some scissors. So, and I used to do hair way back in the day, so... I just had to get some little shears to do his hair. Anyway, uh, when we had gone to the Center for Puppetry Arts, I was telling her how much of a Poe fan I am because my mom used to uh, buy me books ever since I was wee little. Um, when the first book she bought me, I was three years old. So I was already reading and writing when I was three. And one of the first books my mom got me was uh, Edgar Allan Poe, um, Book of Poems. And I loved Annabelle Lee and The Raven. And um, 
So, Anita was telling me about this fan that came from um, this museum, which was from Poe's house. And so she got it, and it's Nevermore. And it's got the raven on it. It says that. I really want to go there sometime. I'm a big fan of his work. It's absolutely amazing. And then I have this old box set of Friday the 13th movies on um, DVD. Then Old Neighbor from back before I moved back into my childhood home had given me. But it didn't have Freddy vs. Jason and a couple other films on it. And Nita had them and she wanted me to have them. Which was um, Jason X. Because I had these a long time ago, but I just don't know what happened to them over the years. So, there was Jason X. And Jason Goes to Hell. And I'm not sure if I still have them all. I will have to reevaluate. I know I have Freddy vs. Jason. And... I think that's all of them, I have to be sure. And I had debated on getting this. I do have, um, I do have the, the digital version on my Xbox One, but, you know, some, it's kind of like books. You just like the physical feel of things in your hands. So, I went ahead and picked up the Friday the 13th, The Game. For Xbox One and if you play and you want to do private matches um, drop your Xbox One gamer tag in the description box below or hit me up on my personal or G3 Facebook pages and we'll do pr private matches I know a lot of people are complaining about the game and blah, blah, blah. I know it's got glitches. I know it's got issues. But I enjoy it. I like it a lot. I think they did a really excellent job. So, um, for an indie game, it's not going to be perfect. But I think it is, for what it is, it's a pretty good game. So, um, but, oh, and they did get one more thing today. I almost forgot. To add to my new horror pops that I've been getting, I got the New York City Comic Con FYE exclusive black and white Norman Bates from Psycho. Sorry for the glare. So, yeah. Very cool. So, um, that is pretty much it. Um, it's kind of late, or, well, yeah, it's late. It's 10 o'clock. I need to take my meds. I'm ready to call tonight. Um, so that's it for this video. Hope you guys have an awesome Friday the 13th. Be safe out there. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.